Okay, in this video I'm going to show you some recording options that you can do with Camtasia Studio to give you easy annotations that you that come up as animations and you do them while you're recording. So the you want to make sure your recording bar doesn't get minimized. Now if you don't want it then you'll have to edit it out in in the post-production. Um, so one simple solution is if your recording area is small enough so that there's a little room for your your recording toolbar here to not get recorded into the video then that'll prevent you having to edit it out afterwards. So in this case the slide I want to annotate I could chop that off and then my recording toolbar will stay um, out of the picture. To make sure it doesn't get minimized to the tray you want to go to tools, options, program, and minimize recorder never and that'll keep your recorder sort of always on top and not minimized after you press the record button. Okay, now let's switch back to my slide. I'm going to click on record and then it gives me the countdown. And then what I want to click on here is screen draw and this is what I wanted to show you. So if you have a tablet or something that makes it easy to draw with, you can click for example on the pen and you can add annotations that then come up with uh, synchronized with your voice in as animations in your video. So there's a pen tool and you can of course change the color and the width. There's a shape tool and you can add shapes and there's a highlighter tool. So these are very easy ways to mark up a slide and add animations that are synchronized without having to do any post-production. So it's a very useful thing. When you're done you just click stop and then we'll show you and what, then, what it looks like. And so now you can see as I move it along here, let me just see. There you go. So you, you can see in the picture there the annotations appearing. And if I were to play, for example, the sound annotations that then come up with uh, you see that they're synchronized so that's a very useful feature especially if you're creating uh, videos with ad-libbed mathematics is what I often had the chance to do it for